Honestly, this is not a list of the top YouTubers that I like, or even top good YouTubers. This is just a bunch of YouTubers who basically helped inspire me. Be the best me I possibly can be. Well, that's not a tongue twister if I ever heard one. <laughs> anyway, these are the people in my life who basically helped me become the content creator I am today. I grew up on the internet, a loner, with little to no interaction with the rest of the world, and in most cases the world shut me out, so in return I shut it out. These people are the people who helped me become more than what I once was. So here's my tribute, here's my list, to the top YouTubers who helped me inspire me to this day. Number 7, Shane Dawson. Say what you want about the guy. However, copy and paste his life onto mine and it's practically the same. Broke, jobless, in one situa shitty situation to another, till YouTube came into our lives and changed it for the better. Music videos such as I'm a fuck up and This Life helped me out in some of my bad times in life and helped me get into a better situation that taught me to laugh at myself and Without that self-defense, honestly, I think I'd be long dead in a ditch a long ass time ago. Number 6. Mr. Creepypasta. I said this in my last list, so I'll keep this short. Mr. Creepypasta helped me get interested in the strange and the creepy, and what's known as literature. Before him, I could not even fucking read. I was reading at a second grade level until about the sixth grade. But then I discovered MCP's channel, and he taught me that reading can be scary good fun. And from then on, I worked through my disabilities to learn how to read and eventually narrate and get to the point where I am now. Number five, Nigga Higa. This guy, I love this guy. That would all that I would really need to say if not for this next part, so why don't I explain a little bit more. If it wasn't for this guy being on the internet, um, I would probably not be here right now. His video, How to Be Gangster and How to Be a Ninja, essentially introduced me to YouTube and in return the internet. Actually, here's a fun story. One of the URLs, or even first words I learned how to spell, was YouTube.com, and that's just because of this guy's videos right here, because I would re-watch his videos over and over again, laughing with my friends, showing it to different people, obsessively and compulsively waiting for him to upload new content. And to be honest, I did this for quite a while, probably up until about last year, or maybe the year before that, and then I stopped watching him due to other things in my life. Now, let's move on. Number 4, Mr. Repsion. Mr. Repsion is someone who I more recently started watching. However, nonetheless, his content on YouTube helps me get to my day-to-day -day operation. Well, this is really a hard one to talk about, but this guy is really great at self-help. He has great videos that provides great commentary on religion and general queries about morality. And simply put it, this guy knows what he's talking about, and he admits when he's wrong when he is wrong. Even though I may disagree with him on a few subjects and topics here and there, most of the time I can't say I really disagree with him, and having someone to reaffirm my own beliefs definitely has helped me in my life. Number 3. Cat Icarus. Now, I know what you're gonna say, but just hear me out. I actually got the pleasure to meet and talk with, and honestly work, with Caddy. But nonetheless, this guy's a fucking machine. He works like no one else has. He has a hard situation and works with what he has and simply makes the best of it. His determination to actually work and get his YouTube thing working is just a great inspiration for me. His videos are flat out quality streamed into our eyes via a rainbow of magical funness brought by Nyan Cat. But nonetheless, this guy inspires me to work every day and every time I do it. And every time I watch him, I just get this urge to work. It's probably only because I actually got a chance to talk to him about his YouTube and some of the things he goes through and some of the things he deals with. But to be honest, this guy inspires me like no one else has. So, yeah, accept that as that. Number two, some ordinary gamers. This guy has a connection with his fans. Although his videos are probably not the best in quality, his interactions with his fans and watchers are just fantastic. 
This guy always produces videos on time, and to be honest, I want to have some of the same situation going on with you guys. However, I don't want to flat out rip them off. Just the amazing interactions part. Also, for those of you who've been commenting on my intro, it's because I happen to use the same audio library as him, Kevin McLeod, who happens to make all the music that we both happen to use. It's royalty free, and it's like a free audio library that we both draw from. So I'm sorry if we tend to overlap sometimes, but he doesn't own the music, and I don't own the music. Um, it's simply royalty free music, and yeah. This guy creates great videos. Every time I watch him, I get this urge to create content, and he honestly makes me want to have more of an interaction with you guys. I'm still working out how to create a format that will let us do that, but nonetheless, I'll find it. And number one, Tats. All you guys may probably have known of Tats Top Videos. Tats Top Videos is a YouTuber over the last year I've gotten to know. I have helped him a lot in return, and I've helped him a lot, and in return he's helped me a lot. Through tough times and deeply personal talks and just general moments of friendship, Tats helped me turn my old content, which was just a bunch of shit, to what I'm doing now. He helps me with thumbnails and generally still teaches me how to use Sony Vegas, as I'm still honestly an amateur. Tats Hot Videos is a YouTuber whom inspired me to make better content, and in reality, by talking, hanging, playing, and just having fun while working with him and him working with me, he's probably became my best friend, and that's why he's probably the most influential, best YouTuber I know. Tats Hot Videos is my number one pick, so fuck it, deal with it. Thank you guys for watching this video. I would like to ask you to comment what creepy pasta or shit pasta should I do next time. Also, take a note that you can watch all of my videos first on Patreon. It's a simple reward for donating a dollar a month. So if you're interested in watching my project files as I work on them, you can donate a dollar and say fuck it, I did something. Don't forget to mention that my artist has a DeviantArt page, and it's in the link in the description below, so you can check that fucking shit out too, because I am a bad person, and I am promoting again. I uh, should have a new creepypasta uploaded probably the very next day after this is uploaded, so you can forget about this video as soon as possible. This has been That Creepy Reading, providing content for all of you fat weirdos just as like myself. So I'm signing off.